When recording your screen, you want to use something that's free, accessible, and easy to use. A screen recorder that's covering a complete process of recording, editing, and exporting your screen recordings. In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how you can make this happen with Veed's online screen recorder. To get started, simply head over to Veed.new in your browser and click on record in the editor's menu, or simply save yourself some time and click on the first link in the description. All right, from here, you're prompted to choose a recording layout. When you select one, make sure you allow your browser to use your camera and microphone. Depending on the layout you chose, you'll be able to record your webcam, microphone, and a shared screen separately or simultaneously. In case you would like to record your screen, you'll be prompted to select the entire screen, a window or a Chrome tab before you get started. Or if you prepared for something such as a presentation, you can head over to slides or slides and webcam and upload PDFs, PowerPoint projects and keynotes into your recording, which we'll also do in this example. Once you uploaded something, you can easily maneuver through the slides on the left side of the screen or by using the arrow keys on your keyboard. All right, so next, if you take a look below the screen recording canvas, you should be able to see a menu. On the left, we have the camera, audio, screen, and slides icon, and you can use this to turn on or off these elements during or before your recording. And further on the right in the menu, you will see themes and backgrounds, and you can use this to customize the style and structure of your screen recording, which even after your recording, you'll be able to further edit in the editor if you wish to do so. And next to that, you will see a prompter or notes option, which is incredibly helpful if you prepare the script for a presentation presentation or if you made a simple list of bullet points you would like to cover in your video. And final tip before we start recording, in the settings menu, make sure the right camera and microphone is selected for your recording. And then if you're set and ready to record, make sure you click on the start recording button at the right top corner. After the countdown, the screen recording will start and you can start presenting. During your screen recording, you can choose to pause and resume the recording. You can retake it or finish it by clicking on the stop button. Once you click on stop, your screen recording will render and you can watch it back. Now you can choose to finish and export your recording instantly, or you can choose to edit your video. For instance, if you click on edit, you'll be taken to Veed's online video editor, which will instantly allow you to trim or cut out mistakes or empty spaces in your footage. And besides that, you can customize the styling, crop the video, add automatic subtitles, text, music, stickers, audio visualizers, and much more. And then if you're satisfied, click on the export button in the right top corner to export your edited screen recording. However, if you were already satisfied with the recording in the first place, make sure to click on finish recording and you'll be instantly taken to the export page. If you would like to download your video, head over to the download button, click on download mp4 and you should be able to find the video in your downloads folder. And also if you quickly set up an account, you'll be able to host your videos on Veed and you can share your video with your friends colleagues, family or students. And the best thing is everyone can leave timestamped comments if you wanna receive feedback or start discussions. All right, so that's how you record your screen from A to Z. I hope it was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck and have a nice day.